My name is Adam Bruce, and I'm the great-great-great-grandson of Admiral Lord Cochrane. Well, his life was full of regret. He was a member of Parliament for Westminster. He was in favour of the ordinary man. He was for parliamentary reform. He was regarded by some as dangerously, possibly revolutionary. This man sank half of Napoleon's fleet. Lord Cochrane, qui à la tête d'une quarantaine de navires incendiaires de brûlot, et qui devait être lancé donc sur la flotte française pour l'incendier. C'est un véritable désastre. He always said in his in his autobiography that he was a, a very unromantic person, but he had a very romantic life. Napoléon, qui était un, un visionnaire, a vu en Cochrane un, ben un autre visionnaire. He was decorated, but then fell from grace. Accused of fraud, he was condemned and humiliated, and he leaves the British Navy. A man who was clearly extraordinarily talented and gifted. And Convicted and sentenced in the most humiliating manner. And Cochrane had aroused a sufficient number of enemies. By 1817, Lord Cochrane is an unemployed civilian. It's then that he receives the offer from the government of the new Republic of Chile to take charge of the first national squadron and fight for the independence of Chile, Peru, Brazil and Greece. The idea was to rescue Napoleon from Santa Helena and take him with Cochrane to Chile. And see Napoleon and discuss with him the possibility of establishing uh, an empire in South America. You can never know with Cochrane because he has a way of um, fulfilling these extraordinary notions he gets. And, and what happened to the Esmeralda? It was captured and... and uh, obviously it was captured and was part of the uh, Chilean fleet from that in ahead. Para el Perú no es una figura muy grata. O fato é que o Brasil possui toda a Amazônia por blefe de Cochrane. Ele permite ao Brasil anexar o que é hoje 40% do território brasileiro, a Amazônia. Os Aimnes tinham apostado por essas apetências. E o que é também nos diz na história ou se catastrofe do Flamengo? Porque um personagem muito engenhoso, ou seja, de por si ele era um inventor. E ele continuou a perfeccionar o seu óleo, que ele queria. Este era um óleo para uso civil. Ele trouxe os primeiros tools de óleo para a agricultura, para o Chile, para este novo país. Uh, so that's a big, huge innovation, and he started to make farming, carrots and things like that, and cattle, and the whole thing. And even Pablo Neruda himself wrote a poem for him. Goodbye, sailor. The southern night travels with your ship and lifts its cup of stars to the navigator and his wandering destiny as liberator of peoples. I'm not an admiral. I'm just a foot soldier in the green energy revolution and I'm trying to do my bit to discover a bit more about my ancestor and about what he did here in Chile and together we can set off on that journey.